This is how gold jewelry is turned back into gold bars. First, the old chains and broken pieces are gathered and checked for their carat, because jewelry is always mixed with metals like copper, silver, or zinc. Then the pieces are placed into a strong crucible made from graphite or ceramic and a powdery flux such as borax is added so the metal can melt smoothly and the dirt and oxides can separate from the gold. Then the crucible goes into a high heat furnace where the temperature rises until the jewelry melts into one bright liquid pool and the flux forms a glassy layer on top that holds all the impurities. Then the worker removes the crucible and pours the glowing gold into a heavy bar mold letting the slag stay behind so only the clean metal flows in. Then the gold begins to cool inside the mold and slowly takes the shape of a solid bar. Then the bar, still extremely hot, is grabbed with tongs and dropped into water to quench it, which makes it cool instantly and wash off any loose residue. Then the cooled bar is taken out, cleaned and weighed so the final mass can be recorded. Even though the bar is still an alloy and would need more refining to become pure 24 karat gold,